A new term is quietly reshaping how we think about maximizing AI performance, context engineering. The shift began with a simple observation from Shopify CEO Toby Lutke, who tweeted that he preferred context engineering over prompt engineering because it better describes the core skill of providing all necessary context for an LLM to solve tasks. This sparked widespread agreement among AI practitioners, with experts noting that old prompt tricks, like I'll pay you $100 if you get it right, no longer provide performance boosts. The real advantage now lies in assembling context well to reduce what one developer called the fog of war for the model. This evolution reflects a fundamental change in how AI systems work. Traditional prompt engineering focused on finding the right words and phrases to coax better responses from models. It spawned countless courses teaching users specific tricks and formulations. But as models have grown more sophisticated, these techniques have become less effective. Many tools now automatically enhance user prompts behind the scenes. For instance, when asking an image generator for a fun retro futuristic cover, the system might expand this into a detailed description, including specific visual elements, color palettes, and stylistic choices that produce superior results. Context engineering operates at a different level entirely. Rather than focusing on how to ask questions, it centers on what information to provide. When you upload documents to ChatGPT's O1 Pro or share files with Claude, you're engaging in context engineering. The question becomes, are you giving the LLM the right information it needs to deliver the output you're seeking? This isn't just about document selection. It's a genuine engineering challenge involving how to maintain context across complex systems. The importance of context engineering becomes clear when examining agent architectures. Cognition, the company behind Devon AI, published an influential piece called Don't Build Multi-Agents that highlighted context transmission problems. In multi-agent workflows, a primary agent breaks down tasks and distributes them to specialized sub-agents, then combines their results. However, this approach often fails because context gets lost in translation between agents. If tasked with building a Flappy Bird clone, one sub-agent might misinterpret instructions and create a Super Mario Bros-style background, while another builds a bird that doesn't behave like the original game. The final agent then struggles to combine these mismatched components. Cognition's solution involves single-threaded linear agents where the same agent handles task breakdown, execution of subtasks, and result combination. This maintains continuous context throughout the process. For extremely large tasks that might overflow context windows, they propose sidelong context compression LLMs that distill conversations and actions into key moments and decisions, creating compressed context that informs subsequent work. This architectural thinking represents just one facet of context engineering's growing importance. Industry experts increasingly recognize it as the primary challenge in building functional AI agents. As Anthropic notes, agents often engage in conversations spanning hundreds of turns, requiring careful context management strategies. The field encompasses three main areas, curating context by managing tokens and agent sees at each turn, persisting context through systems that store and retrieve information over time, and isolating context by partitioning information across agents or environments. The rise of context engineering reflects a broader maturation in AI development. Early AI applications relied on single prompts, but modern systems involve complex, dynamic, agentic workflows. When these systems fail, it's typically not because the underlying models lack capability but because they haven't received appropriate context, instructions, or tools. As models improve, this context gap becomes the primary bottleneck. Context engineering manifests differently across user types. For AI engineers building agentic systems, it involves sophisticated system design challenges like implementing context compression algorithms or designing architectures that maintain information flow across complex workflows. These technical decisions shape the capabilities of agents that eventually reach non-technical users. For everyday users, 
context engineering represents an evolving skill set around information curation and model selection. The release of O1 Pro exemplifies this trend, dubbed God is Hungry for Context by analysts, what significantly outperforms standard O1 when provided with extensive background information. Users who fed it comprehensive company data, including meeting notes and audio recordings, received substantially better strategic recommendations than those using minimal context. This user-level context engineering involves two key competencies, understanding which models excel at processing different types of information and determining optimal information volumes and formats for specific tasks. Some models handle technical documentation better, while others excel with conversational context or multimedia inputs. Key Takeaways Context engineering focuses on providing optimal information rather than crafting perfect prompts. Multi-agent systems often fail due to context loss between agents. Single-threaded agents with context compression show promise for complex tasks. Model selection increasingly depends on context handling capabilities.